the Secret Service cracks down on crime. Success is near, yet danger lies ahead for the government men. Will Jack Holt be alive to share the fruits of victory? He's about to capture the leader of a counterfeit gang, but crooked Capas Island officials incite the natives against him. For us, we gotta get out of here. But how? I don't know. I'm gonna try to break down that back wall and hope they don't see us. Stay under cover. Speaking, make that. the finished referral, all right. And Garrity will do us good for this one. <laughs> I think that bomb got us. Here, take these plates and get to the boat. I'm going to stay and finish the job. You mean you're going back? Yes, and see Arnold. If I can get him, it means that we've rounded up the whole counterfeiting gang. Have we enough proof to make his conviction certain? No, but if I can trick him into playing along with me and get him to talk, he'll convict himself. Now get going. Good luck. You win. Good luck to you. We're going to need it. A joke. You had Farrell and his wife killed, didn't you? Well, I'm the law here. What's wrong with that? When you destroyed Farrell, you also destroyed the counterfeit plates, the only valuable thing on the blasted island. <laughs> Rankin! Rankin! You idiot! When you destroyed Farrell, you blew up the plates as well. Well, how did I know? I couldn't stop the plane and search him. Besides, I was only carrying out your orders. Oh, I'll be the laughing stock of the island. Why, even that nitwit Arnold laughed at me. Hold it, Governor. He isn't any nitwit. When Farrell had you, Arnold tried to take over the gang, backed up by a gun. What? Why, yeah. He's the boss of that boat outfit. Why didn't somebody tell me this before? Uh, I'll fix that Arnold's ideas fast. <laughs> I tell you, Quist, we can't keep these men locked up in the hold forever. We're keeping them there until Arnold gives the orders to release them. Oh, Quist! Yeah? Nick's wife is signaling from shore. Let's see what she wants. It's her, all right. Man a boat and bring her aboard. Hold it, Captain. Don't try to get away! You already said nobody's leaving this island. Take another look, Quest. You're coming back to the trading what post with... What fun I am! Come on! Look, that man forced her to go with him. Yeah. What do you make of it, Quest? Well, there's only one answer. She has the plates and was trying to make a getaway. Think we ought to go ashore? I should say not. Only our guns keep those mutineers in check. All right, Slug, hurry up down here. You hear anything? Not enough to learn anything. They were arguing about going ashore. Are they going? No. Well, we ain't going to wait around here much longer. I'm going to get some fresh air if I get killed doing it. That goes for me, too. So, your fine little plot failed, Mr. Arnold. Like a bad penny, I come back to spoil your plans to take over my domain. Your domain. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Only the war has let you get by. The rail laws on the other side of the island. Your knowledge will do you no good. Big shot, I'm keeping you prisoner until I'm paid plenty for the trouble you caused here. Wait till I get my men ashore. It'll be a different story. Uh, we'll see about that. Lock him in his room. Beat it. I'll call you when I need you. Yes, sir. Can you 
you're elected. Stand guard. Well, why me? Why? Because if you hadn't been such a good shot, we wouldn't be in this mess now. <laughs> You were killed. So did the other monkeys. I'll take care of them later on. Right now, I'm getting you out of here. Your number's up. Yes, they threatened me for no reason at all. I know. I heard you quarrel with Garrity. You heard what? Enough to know that you're the boss. I've been dealing with the wrong one. Now, come clean, Arnold. Why, I, uh... All right, I've got the plates. I can manufacture my own bankroll. I don't need you. No. Wait. You win, Farrell. I'm the boss. They all work for me. Get me away from here and you're in with me 50-50. You have the plates. We'll beat it to the other side of the island, catch a mail boat. Let Garrity's men handle the men on my boat. That might have been a good idea. But it can't be done now. Because the plates are on the boat with my wife, and there's where we're headed. Come on, out the winter fast. They're calling out the natives. That means they'll hunt us down and kill us. They'll have to catch us first. This time, they've got no plane. I've taken care of that. Hagen, load up that plane and take off. And if you fail to get them, don't come back. And No. I'm fed up. I'm not going to do any more of your dirty work. No more mass murder for me. It's up to you. But I... On your way. Get in that plane and take off. You send for me, Mr. Garrity? Yes, more trouble. Play inside. Lava, you must hunt them down and kill them both. Understand? Kill them both. You understand. Garrity! Somebody put the plane out of commission. The engine's wrecked. That's Rankin's work. Go gather your men. Yeah. You find Rankin and lock him up. I want to take care of him myself. Right. The lava. I must speak to you. You mustn't send your people out on this manhunt again. But Mr. Garrett, the order. That murderer. I'll tell you the truth. It wasn't White Man Farrell that bombed your people. It was Garrity's man at his orders. He means to kill more of you. Oh, what? What can I do? He's the law here. Get the real law on the other side of the island. Now hurry, unless you want all your people wiped out. I'll go with you. Well? It's no use, boss. Rankin's disappeared into thin air. Did you search the village? Yeah, he's not there. Mr. Quist, Mr. Arnold and Farrell are signaling from shore. They want to come aboard. Great. That means they have the plates. Get a boat ashore and pick them up. Help them, Davis. 
I thought you had deserted us. I meant to, but this roughneck had other ideas. When I caught her, she was trying to signal the boat. Good work, Crimp. Farrell will be pleased to know that she's safe here with us. Don't flatter me. Nick was the reason I left. Don't worry. He won't see you again. Lock her up and stay outside the door. Come on. You, get on the window and don't leave it for a minute. Well, the setup is perfect with her here. Farrell is sure to come back, and we'll have a wonderful homecoming. <laughs> ah, it's good to be aboard again. Well, why the frozen pans? Neither one of you said it was since we landed. Mr. Quist will explain he's in his cabin. Oh, Quist, eh? Come on, Arnold, let's take away his authority. Welcome guest with you. Get out of the chair and let the real boss sit down. Put him wise, Arnold. He's in the no quest. We reached an understanding. Get out of there. I need a cigar. I'm dying. Well, I'm sorry about this, Farrell. Okay, okay. Then I take it you have the plates. You guessed it. Bring my wife in here and I'll give you a look at them. Your wife? She's not on board. Not on board? She's double-crossed you, Farrell. You were a fool to let her have the plates. She'd never double-cross me. She know I'd wring her neck. Something else has happened. He's right, boss. She signaled from the shore, but Crimp took her back in the jungle. Crimp! Well, that means that Garrity's got the plates by now. What then? The only thing we can do is wait till it's dark. Then we'll go ashore and take care of Crimp and Garrity, too. I'll tell the captain. Everything all right? Why you ask me? You were listening, weren't you? Go in and ask the boss. What's coming off, boss? Farrell knows everything. Uh, not everything. Lock that door. Why the long face, Captain? Mm -hmm. Say, Farrell, are we getting out of here soon? Not for some time. Why? Because we're sitting on a keg of powder. We can't keep those men locked up in the hole much longer. Ah, oh, cut out the whining. You went into this thing with your eyes open, and now you can't take it. You're right. I can't take it. I joined this ship on the level. When I found out the real lowdown, well, I was too far in to do anything about it. I'm fed up. I'm going to throw in with those men in the hole and take this ship back to the USA. Now you can go and tell the boss. Wait a minute. Maybe you and I can talk business. I'm getting fed up, too. If you're on the level, give me the key to that radio room. Well, the radio is out of commission. I can fix it. Yeah. And keep your eyes on those bozos. You're taking a chance of being marooned on the island. And the captain wouldn't stand for it either. We know where the plates are. Could we help it if there's an accident? As for the captain, he needn't know anything about it. Yeah, but Farrell, he'll never let us go ashore without him. It's your job to see that he's unable to ask to go. Calling United States Coast Guard Patrol. Come in, please. Started the engines. Engines, nothing. That's the radio dynamo. Well, don't stand there. Go and stop whoever's trying to use it. Come in, Coast Guard. Coast Guard Station A71, standing by. Come in with message. Good work, Coast Guard. This is SS Operator X-4 on gambling ship adventure in trouble. Need help. Relay this message to SS Headquarters. OK, X-4. We'll follow instructions. Give location. Stand by, Coast Guard. Here comes location. We're anchored off the island of...
That means another shindig. Now's our chance to get out of here. Well, how are you going to do it? I'll show you how. Get to it, Davis. Do as I planned. Yeah, now we have to do it. He's a government man. Hurry, we'll get to the boat. All right, boss, she's open. Get up there and throw that hatch back. What about them? the crew? Forget them. They mustn't be allowed to shoot off their mounts. As soon as Davis comes, we'll get to the boat. are at last in control. But will Arnold interfere? Or perhaps Garrity and Arnold have joined forces. Will they be able to thwart Kay's last brave efforts? Ah! 